In this video I'm just going to show you how you can use the play cursor in conjunction with a selection box to make exact edits of anything that you want. So here I have a large file and I just want to cut out the animation at the beginning of this file. So as you can see here this video file has an animation before it kicks into the actual video and I just want to cut this animation out. So what I'll do to start is to make a selection box. So I hold the shift key down on my keyboard and I just hold the left button on my, on my mouse and a selection box is made. So once the selection box is made I can grab the play cursor and go to exactly where I want the edit to be made. So here at the beginning you can see that there's a little bit of fade here and I want to just get it exactly where it starts. So there I'm pretty comfortable is where um, I want it to begin. So I've just placed my play cursor to the point where I want it to begin and then I just right click and I select snap snart to play cursor. So as you can see the selection box has now jumped exactly to where the play cursor is. So that's where I want it to start. So now I'll go to the where I want it to end. So I'll just grab the play bar again and then I want it to end just around there. So I'll just zoom in using the scroll wheel on my mouse and I will go to exa the exact point where it ends. So there. I'm pretty happy with that. Right click and I select snap end to play cursor. And then I can just copy and paste that into the mixing screen and I know that I've made an exact edit of the animation at the beginning of that video file. Uh, another thing I just want to show you is if you wanted to make an exact cut of something in the mixing screen. So let's say I wanted to cut out this part here, that just the TV coming in and out. Okay. So what I'll do is I'll set up a, I'll hold the shift key on my keyboard and create a selection box. So I made a selection box within the mixing screen, and now I just where I want it to end. I want this part of the TV program to end so I want I want this whole section out. Now you can see that it's snapping the the, the um, selection box is snapping at the moment and I, I don't want that to happen so I can just turn off the snap to grid here and then you can see it'll stop snapping. So I want to cut out this part so I just got to the point where I want it to be cut and then I right click and select snap st snap start to play cursor so and this will continue on so I want it to end there and then I'll just select snap end to play cursor so I want this whole area to be cut out of this file and to do so I'm happy with that and then I just right click and I select cut and then just push these two together it's made two different segments now but I've just cut out that area that I wanted out and there we go so again you can do precise editing with selection boxes and using the play bar snap to start snap to end to make exact precise cuts very very quickly very very easily and um, it's a really very nice tool to get working very quickly and very easily. Okay, I hope this helps, and if you've got any questions, please don't hesitate to contact me. All the best. Bye-bye.